Welcome back, everybody. I'm so glad you all are here. Um, if you have watched my videos, you know I love high-end stuff. I love autographs. I love relics. I love things that are expensive that you really can't find in the store. But guess what? I can't find anything expensive right now. I have something else in store in the future, but I'm trying to hold back from that. So I'm going to compare this Tops 2020 Baseball Series 1 and Tops 2020 Opening Day. I'm going to see which one is better. Uh, me, personally, I want the high-end stuff, but there's nothing available right now. So I'm going to open, cut both open. Start with Opening Day. Why not? Let's do it. I'm looking for autographs, rookies, things that stand out. And honestly, I'm not really expecting much out of any of these packs. Retail, you really don't find much in retail. So let's start off with this. As a matter of fact, I'm just gonna open up all these packs right now. And just run through all of them because honestly i have no faith that it is anything of value in these that's just my opinion i just i don't know uh if i open up a pack and i have a ten dollar card that was an unsuccessful pack i'm looking for relics autographs and not just a i don't want a danny jansen autograph uh I'm not looking for a Roddy Tellez, short print, or no crap like that. I need hits. I'm looking for hits. You don't spend your money looking for average players. Don't get me wrong. You two guys I named, you're big leaguers. And being in the big leagues is a huge deal. You can tell your grandchildren about how you had a quick cup of coffee in the bigs. But... As a collector, I'm looking for the best of the best. And I'm searching right now. So let's do it. Opening day. I'm not really a big fan of opening day. I was actually looking for Prism. When I walked into this Walmart. And all they had was opening day. And 2020, Tops 2020. And they had some 2019 Series 1 really wasn't looking into that too much i'm really uh looking to expand my collection and so far if you have been watching i have done so i have withheld some yelling and screaming because i've had some hits recently especially with inception uh tops museum 2019 Panini. Oh man, that box was outstanding. If you all go back and look at that video, it was only six minutes. But that video, it made my day. Like literally, I I did everything in my power not to scream loud. I even dropped my card and clapped my hands on the video. That was so good. But hopefully. This opening day, Tops Baseball Series 1 showdown can be of some justice. Okay, so here, let's go. And as you all can see, I have changed. I'm down here in my basement. I don't want to wake up my wife. She works really hard. You all have no idea. She's been at home. And she's probably made 300 masks in the past four days for people that need masks and selling them for 10 bucks a piece and making a profit while trying to save lives. Look at that Ronald Acuna Jr. That's an awesome card. Awesome card. And the Gavin Lux. Oh no, sorry about that. Dustin May. Saw that Dodger and thought Gavin. I'm about to shoot through these and let's see if anything is special in here. And all my Cubs players, you know I'm going to put them in the PC. Every last Cubs player that you see, get that Gavin Lux. That's awesome. 
every single Cubs player that you see, if I don't speak on him, trust me, he's going in the PC. Willie Mays. Man, I love my Hall of Famers and phenomenal players. Let's go, let's go. What you got? What you got? Nothing in. Oh, let me go to that. March 26, 2020. What you do, Liam? Liam? March 26, 2020. We were all in quarantine. So what did you do? Nothing. Because opening day did not happen. All right, let's go. Pause. I heard these cards were worth a penny penny, but I'm going to keep on going. Because I'm looking for something in particular. I'll put that Vlad on the ground right there. Look for special cards and tops baseball. 2020 series one and two packs. You can pick the game if your player hits the home run. Guess what? That's not happening. <laughs> it's not funny, but hey, we must deal with the situation with humor because uh, we have no idea what's coming next. So let's go that one, 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 that one. Love, Glaber. Theo gave him up for almost nothing. But I'm not going to knock you, Theo. Look at Victor Robles. He has multiple all-stars in his future. And I predict he will not be in a Washington Nationals uniform after 2021. That's just my prediction. He's a great player. Somebody's going to go out there and try to get him. They don't utilize him as much in Washington, in my opinion. Paul Goldsmith, Andrew Benatini, and more base. Okay, here we go. Throw that over there. Now, out of that box, in my opinion, With my blue gloves, of course. In this box, I have, I don't know if this is short print, but it looks like one. And I don't care, it's an awesome card. That's going right there in the front for that box. It's a good card. Vlad, put your gold cup. That's going there. This card here. It just actually looks cooler than almost every other card in that pack. Because actually that pack, that box sucked. And uh, Gavin Lux, I'll deal with that one. I have another variation of him. And Dustin May, I have several of you, young man. All right. Cutting open. Them, Tops 20, 20. Baseball Series 1. Let's hope, I hope we get at least a relic out of here or something. Good grief. Uh oh, fix that tripod. Let's get that together. You all are looking. I'm down here in my basement, actually, in my laundry room. I set up right here on my table so I can speak and talk without disturbing the missus because my queen is my queen and I will not have a, having a bad day. Okay, let's go. get that correct. You are looking at my Cubs background. These are calendars. Love my Cubs. Okay. Hey, Dustin, man. Scoot back over there a little bit, brother. All right, young man. There we go. Let me set my area up again. Okay. Dustin, May, Gavin Lux. Liam Hendricks with a nice card. I don't know what that is. Value-wise, Vladdy. And Ronnie, 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 Ronnie. Mr. Opinion Jr. Okay, packs coming out. We have... Oh, man. We have this. 
whatever this is, all these stuff that I'm not gonna use. Okay. And the this to the side, one exclusive rookie card, retrospective. Rookie card, logo, medallion card inside. Hopefully that's a good card. Look, tops will play you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven packs. So now you see what's on the screen right here. I'm gonna move these cards because space is limited. And honestly, I must keep all of my Cubs memorabilia on the screen. I love my Cubs. You all must, you have no idea how much I love my Cubs. Um, just to say how much I love my Cubs, if it's any card that you saw that I pulled at any time that you really, really like, make me offer with my Cubs players. I love my autographs and my relics. I currently have one autographed Cubs card. Kerry Wood, that's all I have. I need a Mark Pryor autograph. I need an Anthony Rizzo, Javier Baez, Chris Bryant, Kyle Schwarber. If any of you have autographs or relics of that card and you see something I have that you like, I am willing to trade. That is the truth. Fly through these cards. And Cody. Ryan Braun. Yeah, liar. Uh, Hands of Alberto. And a lot of the cards I'm about to fly through. Rizzo came to the side. I'll put that up there because hopefully it'll be something in there worthwhile. And I'll be happy about it. Let me shoot through these. New York, Minnesota, Marco Gonzalez. Conforto, Rizzo, my friend, my buddy, my cubby, Peter Alonzo, Morel Kelly, eh, eh. Reese Hoskins, a waste of a set, Bobby Bradley, Giancarlo Stanton, hopefully you can stay healthy, because you are one lucky guy, getting paid millions. <laughs> And cannot get the ball in play. And when you do, you hit home runs. And that was years ago. All right, let's go. My gut told me I would not have any luck with this pack, with these boxes. But I need to bring content to you all because I can't not go three and four days without talking to you all. Look at that Gary Cole, 85. That's awesome. It's not worth anything, but... That card is awesome. I wish I had my face on the card. Staring, looking tough. <laughs> <laughs> he looks so tough, but he's actually tough in the, in on the mound. People get so frustrated with him because you think one thing, he does another. And he does it every time. And now he is getting paid a lot more with the Yankees. Nothing, 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 nothing. Base cards, base cards, base cards, base cards. Johnny Bench, Black Border, that's a nice card. I like that card. Strowman, Cruz, Mancada. We have three packs left plus that. Let's see what we have. Shout outs to everybody that is abiding by the rules staying in the house not going outside wearing your gloves putting your mask on taking care of yourself taking care of your family <clears throat> all that is vital and important right now we must overcome and get past this point and we have nothing nothing 
nothing. Nick Sanzel, horrible year last year. Dustin May, I'll take that. I have two turkey reds of him. And that's amazing. I took one card out. Out of all these packs. <laughs> I don't care, guys. I want you all to see what these packs have to offer. So let's say you're out in Walmart and you have an option. Hey, should I get this? Should I get that? Remember, Bobby Blee's Blue broke that case and he got nothing. Look at this. Look at this. I'm not complaining. This is just what it is. It's a lottery. It is absolutely a lottery. Reese Hopkins, Hoskins again with nothing. And what is our gold turkey red gallo? Nico Horner, Adbert, Azale, and Yuri Gurriel. Disappointed is not the word for this break. That's why I like high end breaks. High end breaks, disappointment is not happening. You're going to pull some fantastic cards. Numbered rookies, great players, all stars. Not today. Here we go. Let's see. Can I get lucky on the last pack before I reach my other one? That wasn't good, but. Yeah, base cards anyway. Um, a little frustrated that I had nothing here. Kyle Lewis. Hopefully he'll be a good player in the future. Trevor Bauer. I like you, but I don't like your mouth. You talk too much. Uh, Walker Bueller. I have plenty of those turkey red cards. And that is it for this break. After I pop open this. Hopefully, those cards are horrible. Honestly, you all, like, that's the reason why I hate retail. I'd rather just spend money. I'd rather spend $100, $150, $200, $250, $300 on a box that I know I'm going to get my money's worth back. Because this was horrible. Steven Strasburg, wow. That's a rookie card relic from Steven Strasburg. Big card. This card is not worth what I spent for this box, but I love having this card in my collection because I don't have it. All right, everybody. This was my mediocre break for the evening, but that's all fine. Uh, we need days like this. We need days when we have crazy hits. We need days when we have horrible hits. It's a part of the hobby. I love you all, man. I really, 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 truly do. Um, be safe. And if you're at home with your kin folks and you ain't kissed your loved one in a long time, do me a favor. Just go in there and reach out. Give everybody a hug. Give them a kiss and tell them you love them. Because you do. It's really important. These times right now, we have no idea what the next day is going to bring to us. So right now, today, while you have the opportunity, while you have the breath, tell that person that you love, that you love them. It means so much. Bobby bleeds blue, will always bleed blue. But my heart bleeds regular blood like every person else on this earth. I love everyone, every each individual. And hopefully these car breaks that myself and other people in the hobby can uh, provide you all with uh, content that will ease your mind and give you a, a better sense of uh, yourself. Because right now we need each other really, really bad. Uh, have a good night, and I have more content coming in the future. Have a wonderful night. Bye-bye.